Okay, cool. So I'm going to make a very quick video on how to use Zoom, um, which is great for just keeping in contact with your friends, a group of your family or whatever online. So if you have your Google web page open like that, just type Zoom, Z-O-O-M, into your search bar, click return, and it gives you a couple of options there, and go into where it says zoom.us, Zoom video conferencing, web conferencing, webinars. So just click on that. And you can see it opening up there for you. Now it gives you a number of options. Sign up for free, which is what we want to do. So go into your sign up for free. So you're at the sign up free page and it says your work email address. Put in whatever your email address is there. Okay. So I'm going to put in one that I just made up for the purpose of this. Okay, and then click on sign up. And Zoom, we'd like to help you get the most out of Zoom by sending you resources along the way. You can unsubscribe at any time. I'm just going to click on confirm there just so that I can get in. Now it says we've sent an email to that address and I have to click the confirmation link in that email to begin using Zoom. Okay, so I've actually logged into that address over here further. So I'm just going to have a look at that now okay so going into my email address I click on the last email I got which was from zoom to activate my zoom account and go down and click on activate account there okay now it's bringing me into zoom are you signing up on behalf of the school I'm gonna click no there continue and then it comes to this welcome page welcome to zoom Put in your first name, your last name, password, and confirm password, and then click on continue. And it should bring you into the page that you actually want to get to, the main page in Zoom. Okay, so you're into your Zoom page. I'm just going to span out. It looks like that. But the most important thing you want to do is up here. So on those three tabs up at the top right hand corner, you have schedule a meeting join a meeting or host a meeting okay so we'll say yeah you know a friend or a son or daughter or someone has said let's do a zoom meeting they might have sent you an email or a text with a message to join a zoom meeting so what you do click on that click on that it goes to join a meeting and type in the meeting ID number that they give you and then click join. Okay, that is if they ask you to join a meeting and you should be good to go at that point. But if not, if it's yourself who wants to set up a meeting, you can click there on schedule a meeting. And down here it gives you lots of different, you know, it's fairly, you'll, you'll be able to follow it. It's straightforward enough. My meeting, you could put in there, enter your meeting description. You don't have to write in anything there, but you could say family quiz or something. Okay, so in there, why don't we write family get together. Okay, um, when? Now, because this is an American website, the dates tend to be backwards, okay? So let's click on the calendar there, May. So we'll say we're going to do it on Friday morning. So click on Friday, the 22nd, um, 10 a.m. is fine, suits me, one hour, that's fine as well. Scroll down your page. For this plan, it's a free plan. It only allows a meeting for up to an hour, but that's normally if you just want to have a chat with someone. You know, it's probably half an hour, whatever. And if it switches off, you just rejoin. Time zone, it says there, just right click on that. Because again, this is for US and Canada. And I'm gonna go down, there's Dublin actually. Just click on Dublin there. 
Okay, recurring meeting, no. I'm just gonna leave that blank. Host, video here, host, yes. If you're holding, you want to be able to see whoever you're talking to and you want them to see you, etc. So just click on for that. Um, enable them to join before you, yes. These are all just things you can kind of have, uh, you know, play around with because they mightn't make sense straight away, but save those details there. We'll bring you to the next page. On the next page, it shows my meeting, family get together, um, what time it's on, May the 22nd at 10 in the morning. It gives you a meeting ID number there. And what you can do is send that to your family or friends or copy that invitation there and send it to them as well by email. So a little bit more complicated to set up, but once shown or once going through it once or twice, you get the hang of it. Um, up there, then it has your start this meeting whenever you're ready for it. Um, obviously, it's easier when you're joining the meeting because you're only putting in one piece of information. Try it out. It's a great way to get to meet your friends or family for a short period of time. Have a cup of tea with them and a chat and a catch up. Um, and there are plenty of other tutorials which might be clearer on uh, YouTube as well. Don't be afraid to Google do search for this in Google search bar, you know, um, steps to join Zoom or something like that and check it out. Good luck. Take care. Bye.